Hey, very good Monday evening, everybody. Thanks for stopping by for your Aggie Land Carpet One forecast. Lots of clouds in the sky today. Tall ones, too. Look like they're going to try to bring in a little rain. Just couldn't really get it going here for today, but we do have a chance for tomorrow. Here's your pinpoint forecast. What we have going on is a weak cold front moving into the Brazos Valley. Really, it's just drier air moving in, and that's what's going to be the key for tomorrow. With that in the neighborhood, by lunchtime, cloud cover starts developing. Then as we head into the afternoon hours, we'll scatter rain and a few thunderstorms will be possible as we get the heat of the day going up close to 100 degrees for some. Now, notice there's some areas of red in there. That's going to be the potential for some stronger thunderstorms. Some gusty wind, some damaging uh, wind as well will be possible. With those, the biggest thing, brief every downpours, cloud ground lightning, thunder, and that heavy rain. So let me show you as we go through the day. Again, widespread severe weather, not anticipated. But if we were to find some hail... Pea size, maybe larger, up to the size of quarters. Winds in excess of 40 miles per hour and a brief heavy downpour that could put down half an inch to an inch of rain in just half an hour to 45 minutes' time. It won't be for everybody. Remember, it's only about a 30 to 40% chance. So overnight tonight, we'll call it a scattered cloud cover overhead. Winds are shifting around as that weak front dives in, 75 to 78. Pretty humid when you wake up in the morning. Temperatures in the afternoon will be on the toasty side, and that rain chance really comes up, getting into those afternoon hours up to a 30 to 40% shot, anywhere from the mid to upper 90s. That is, if you stay away from the rain, you find rain at the right time tomorrow, we may be cooler. It's not exactly colder air that's moving in, but less humid air. So that means it will still be hot, but those mornings will be very comfortable. Upper 60s, low 70s, daytime highs, while still close to 100, will be more of a dry heat. So at least that's the semi-good news for the second half of your week. Latest details are up at gbtx.com. We'll run the numbers again. We'll give you the update tonight at 10 p.m. Otherwise, have a good evening.